I'm trying to explain to you is, come in. You said you wanted to see me, Mrs. Warbeck. Come right in. Hello there. Good to see you again. It's nice to see you. You're awfully lucky, Mrs. Walker. Lovely little girl you have here. Thank you. And Susan's the reason I asked you to drop down. She's a little confused, and I thought maybe you could help to straighten her I'd out. I'd be glad to. Would you please tell her that you're not really Santa Claus? That there actually is no such person? Well, I'm sorry to disagree with you, Mrs. Walker, but not only is there such a person, but here I am to prove it. No, no, no. You misunderstand. I want you to tell her the truth. Uh, what's your name? Chris Crinkle. I'll bet you're in the first grade. Second. I mean your real name. That is my real name. Second grade? It's a progressive school. Oh, it's a progressive school. May I have this gentleman's employment card, please? Yes, Mrs. Walker. This dress is very cute. Where did you get such a lovely outfit? Here at Macy's. We get 10% off. Please don't feel that you have to keep pretending for Susan's benefit. She's a very intelligent child and always wants to know the absolute truth. Good, because I always tell the absolute truth. Now, about your school, what's the name of your teacher? Mrs. Haney. Mrs. Haney. Here it is, Mrs. Walker. Thank you. Well, what else do you do besides read and play games? We have rest periods. One half hour. Oh, I don't suppose you care for that, eh? No. We're not allowed to talk or anything. Tuesday, Chester Richards, he kept talking all the time. My, that was bad, eh? Yes. Mrs. Haney made him stay resting all alone for nearly an hour. Susan, dear, uh, would you go out and uh, talk to Miss Adams for a minute and I'll be right with you? All right. Goodbye. Goodbye, young lady. Hope to see you again. Thank you. I hope so, too. Goodbye. Goodbye. Uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Uh, Mr. Kringle. I'm sorry, but we're going to have to make a change. Change? Um, the Santa Claus that we had two years ago is back in town, and I feel that we owe it to have him. Have I to... done something wrong? Oh, no. No. 